You know, they fuck up your livers, destroy your stomach linings, right? You people are killing yourselves because you're afraid to have anxiety or a mood swing or be shy at a party. <laughs> you people gotta stop hiding your feelings with these drugs. Get a personality. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with not having a personality. I don't have one. I don't have a personality. That's why I did a lot of coke in the 80s. <laughs> what a great fucking drug, man. <laughs> yes, every joke killed on coke. Every woman I, f I fucked on coke was grateful. <laughs> I used to love to play basketball on coke. <laughs> if somebody had the ball, I would say, give me the fucking ball or I will kill you. <laughs> He's gonna do a lot of fights on coke. And I never lost a fight on coke. I was under TV. My best win was a come from behind victory against my mother-in-law. I swear to God, she had blue hair. One tit was bigger than the next. And she was always giving me shit about not making enough money. I, I was ready to throw in a towel in the eleventh round, but I, but I told her to shut the fuck up, you fat bitch. <laughs> the first time ever, she she started crying and shut the fuck up. My oh. best win ever on coke. I tell you, this lady comes in uh, the other day with, she found some pills in her, like, nine-year-old son's jacket pocket. You know, she wants to know what they were. They were like Oxycontin. You know what they are, right? The yeah. pill form of heroin. I mean, why have kids? Why have kids if your nine-year-old is going to be addicted to, to drugs? You know, why? You people agree with me? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. I mean, my, my kids have become drug addicts until we're 19 and 20. <laughs> and I told them, if you can buy drugs on the street, let me match the price. Thank you very much. <laughs>